Welcome to our video about how to create themes and extensions, where we will show you some of the latest features in IBM Cognos Analytics 11 on this topic, including themes, extensions, the welcome page, and the login page. Customization samples are available that demonstrate how to create themes, extensions, and views, otherwise known as perspectives. You can modify these samples to create your own customizations. All of these samples work together to create a customized portal for the fictional Sample Outdoors company. They are best installed in the following order. 1. Import the deployment. 2. Upload and apply the theme. 3. Upload each extension separately or upload all the extensions as one. 4. Upload the welcome page and 5. Upload the login page. You now have the ability to apply your own theme to IBM Cognos Analytics. The theme is applied globally to all of the perspectives in the product. A theme is a zip file that contains spec.json and an images folder. The name of the zip can be anything because it is not used by the product or shown in the user interface. However, you can't use underscores in the name. Themes are supported in the following areas of the product. You can change the brand icon small, aspects of the app bar, the brand text, the brand icon, and aspects of the nav bar. And on the side, here is the file spec.json for the sample theme supplied. Themes are uploaded to Cognos Analytics. To upload a theme, click Manage, Customizations, and on the Themes tab, click Upload Theme. Navigate and select your theme. Now to apply the theme, select it and click Apply. Refresh your browser and you will see the new theme applied. You now have the ability to add or remove elements in the IBM Cognos Analytics user interface for a perspective. An extension is a zip file that contains spec.json and optional images and JavaScript folders. What is a perspective? The IBM Cognos Analytics user interface is built on an extensible model. In this model, a perspective declaratively defines a new UI screen or capability in the Cognos user interface. The JSON declaration for the perspective describes the layout of the perspective. The following core perspectives are available, Home, Authoring, Dashboard, Modeler, and Common. You can also create your own perspective as shown in the samples samplewelcome.zip and sample extension button open perspective.zip. Extensions are supported in the following areas of the product. You can extend the app bar in the app bar leading group, app bar center group, or app bar trailing group, and you can extend the nav bar in the nav bar leading group or the nav bar trailing group. Here is a screen capture of the sample extensions as they are applied. The sample, sample extensions all.zip, contains all of the following extensions. Number one is adding a button to the nav bar to open a core dashboard. Number two shows how to add a button to open a popular report. Number three shows how to add a button for an important folder. And number four is a button to open a website. Number five shows how to remove the notifications button. Number six adds a menu and multiple menu items. Number seven opens a perspective. And number eight creates and opens a custom perspective. Extensions are uploaded to Cognos Analytics. To upload an extension, click Manage, Customizations, and then the Extensions tab. Click the Upload icon, select your extension, and click Open. The extensions that are rendered in the product are a union of all of the uploaded extensions. Newer extensions will overwrite older extensions with the same name. 
To see our extensions, we'll refresh the browser, and here they are. For example, this is a button has been added to the nav bar to open a core dashboard. The sample welcome page view is actually an extension. It is a zip file that contains spec.json and folders for CSS, images, and JavaScript. It is a copy of the default home page that has been themed, extended, styled, and modified. Rather than using the product CSS, the sample links to its own